All right, next. All right, next is from Mike Durbin. Subject to StarCast All right, 5. wait one second. Wait one second. I don't even know what the question is. Go ahead. Subject to StarCast 5. Hi there, hi there, man. Men. Hey there, men. <laughs> Remember the hey there, man thing that we... Yeah. Uh, I think, uh, it was just announced that StarCast will return this summer. Mark it down your calendars, July 29th to 31st in Nashville, Tennessee over SummerSlam weekend. If you recall, the very first StarCast in Chicago was 2018 is where I first met Conan and Disco and wonderful friendship was born. Are you two legends open to appearing at StarCast? I'm going to predict Glenn says, I work, I have a job, I can't take a weekend off. You got it. <laughs> I work, I have a job, I can't take a weekend off. I'm not going to StarCast. Um, I will say this. Remember, remember Conan when we met Durbin? What he was—he no. was there with. Uh, th- don't you remember Starcast? He was there with Hambone. With him and Hambone, and then they were just marks that listened to Russo's podcast, and they wanted us to get them VIP. Oh, that's right. Of- and they <laughs> were mad because we wouldn't hang out with them. Right. right. You know, like, like, like right. Like the only. There's no way I would hang out with you guys. The only reason I hang out with Joe is because he's on the podcast. But oh, right. you that's are not awful. guys I would hang out with. Let me just say that. Yeah. Okay. Next is from. Um, uh, Next is from Preston Sharp, and the subject is kick Sonny out of the Hall of Fame. You know what I'm saying? Once again, their man. Oh, the, oh here's the their man guy, Preston Sharp. Oh, Sonny has been sent for jail for drunk driving, this time leading to the death of someone you know what I'm saying and stuff and everything, their man. The Hall of Fame is already controversial enough with murders like Jimmy Snooker, their man, and <laughs> like Mike Tyson and Donald Trump and stuff, and everything being members, but is Sonny the right person to be removed? You know what I'm saying? Hogan got removed for dropping the N-word, their man. So why not for Sonny for killing someone while drunk? And buddy, 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 if you don't want to drink alcohol or take drugs, just don't do them. There, man, and stuff and everything. I hope Sonny has to spend the rest of her life eating a hairy oh. for cheap smokes and stuff and everything. You know what I'm saying there, man? Jesus. That's JVD snuffs the rooster. Okay. And this is interesting. This submission of this email was submitted right after the Durban email. Huh. Interesting. Interesting placement, okay? Um, but Sonny's a mess. I feel bad. You know, I, I mean, honestly, people are just g- giving her hate left and right, but that girl's got serious problems. Serious alcohol You know, she's got problems, serious, yeah. serious problems. Out with alcohol, drugs, it's just she's a mess. And it's like it's too bad. Well, I had seen her at this um, – I don't know if I told you this whole story, but – I know you had heat with – you, you You cut a vicious promo on her one time. Yeah. Right. And we played on the show. Right. Well, because she deserved it. And so, um, so, but it wasn't anything personal. It was more for entertainment pur- purposes because I didn't know her. You know what mm-hmm. I'm saying? And so uh, they had this party with our boy, Sean Jacoby of Icon Autographs, um, good friend. And she had that backyard party where Buff showed up and she showed up and ADR showed up. And, but he had a lot of people there. And so her boyfriend was with her, some guy, I don't know this guy is and he was like hey man you know Sonny doesn't really hurt by the stuff you've said on on the podcast it really mean a lot to me you know man to man if you at least tell her you know something she's afraid to go I was like I don't want her to hate me so you know I went over there and I just told her hey you know no personal it's just entertainment you know maybe I went overboard my bad and I apologized uh, and I and I saw how long ago was this it was like uh, six to eight months ago or something maybe less I remember you talking about the the party. So I don't yeah. I don't remember this. Okay, go ahead. Yeah, go on. less than a year ago. Right. And bro, she went up into the ring and she cut a great promo. So did Buff, which I couldn't believe it because he was uh-huh. like really in no shape. He he cut it on Brian Cage and Brian Cage, who's not known for doing good promos, cut a great promo on Buff. I was like, bro, this is a birthday party. These guys are really getting some good, <laughs> you know? Yeah. And. uh but anyways, Sean Jacoby always does it upright. Shouts out to him one more time. But by the end of the night, Sean was complaining about it because he was telling me she was a super pain in the ass to work with, you know, right. and like he didn't want to work with her again, you know. So, yeah, she does have problems, whatever they are. She needs help, man. You yeah. know what I'm saying? And uh, so at the end of the day, she should be in some sort of I'm assuming she's already been to rehab, right? Yeah. Yeah, she's going know, to jail man. now, probably. Yeah, oh, so, definitely. So, they revoked her bail. Yeah, yesterday. she's in jail. Yeah. So, do yeah, you think? She, no... Do you think, due to this incident, she should be taken out of the Hall of Fame? Though, and the guy, the guy being a goofball, he is. But he listed several examples like Snooker. I don't. I don't care. You, yeah, okay, I mean, it's I not can a big give deal. 
It's about yeah. the Hall of Fame. And yeah. you, you know, well, I'm I on record. Think, it's, it's, at the end of the day, you know, it's like, you know, everybody's going to have something that they f***ed up on, right? So we're going to take everybody out of the Hall of Fame? Or are we just going to take people out for murders and drunk driving and racial epithets right. and whatever? We're going to pick and choose who we let in. Okay, then if that's the case, then what are the parameters? What are the rules? My whole feeling is if you voted them in and you already know that they were drunk or they are a drunk or they that's a stain on them. That's a stain they got to live with. You know, I'm not a big fan of if you put somebody in the Hall of Fame, taking them out later, but. Doesn't change my life any, you know, right. any, yeah. yeah.